kids welcome to the maths class today we will do the topic data handling the main objective of today's learning is how to do data handling and how to give answers of the related questions now first i will teach you what is data handling data means any information that is given to us and data handling means sorting the information according to what is available now let me explain this with some examples now in this picture you can see a sun mountains and a house trees and a cat now first we will count the shapes and write the numbers first of all we will count the triangles that how many triangles are there there are 14 triangles now we will count the number of squares and there are 7 squares and now we will count the number of rectangles and there are 5 rectangles now we will count the number of circles and there are 8 circles now we have 14 triangles 8 circles 7 squares and 5 rectangles and now we will give answer of some questions question number 1 name the shape that occurs the most and the answer is triangles now next question is name the shape that occurs the least and the answer is rectangles now let's do an another example now this is the scene of the forest and we can see different animals here now we have to answer the following questions question number 1 how many monkeys are there now we will see the picture that there are four monkeys so the answer is four monkeys now the next question is which is the tallest animal now we will again look the picture the tallest animal is the giraffe so the answer is giraffe now next question is how many birds are there now we will see the picture again that there are two birds so the answer is two birds and now the last question is how many animals are there in all now again in the question in all is there it means we have to find out the total number of animals now we will see the picture again that there are 12 animals in all so the answer is 12 animals now kids let's recall what we have learned today first we learned the meaning of data handling then we learned how to sort the things and then we learned how to give answers of the related questions so kids i hope you all understood what is data handling and how to give answers of the questions so open your maths book and snap homework and do the related sums thank you